Hey guys, welcome to your general reading for Aries. Uh, what's good? What's good that's coming towards you guys? So we're gonna take a look and see what's good that's coming towards you, and then we'll finish off the read to see what else you guys need to know. Look out for work on. This is gonna be for your March 2024. You can apply this to any of your placements. So um, keep in mind that these are general messages. Take what resonates and leave the rest behind. If this message didn't resonate with you, you may take a look at your other placements. Keep in mind that these are collective messages for the collective. Um, for the collective uh, Aries people, not tapping into one specific person's energies in particular. If you're looking for a reading that's tailored specifically to your unique situations and your energies, I suggest you to uh, book a personal reading with me. The link for that is in the description box below. Like, share, comment, subscribe, hit the notification bell so that you guys get notified on uh, when my new videos post and when I go live. Also, if you guys are interested in following me on TikTok, Instagram, my other YouTube channel that's dedicated solely to my travels, the links for those are in the description box below. Support me on there too. Also, if you guys didn't know, I am doing a giveaway for a free 30 minute personal reading with me. Uh, to enter the giveaway, check out the details that I posted in the community tab on my YouTube page, okay? I will announce the winner on March 8th. Tell me about Aries. What's good coming towards Aries? What's good that's coming towards Aries? What's good that's coming towards Aries for March 2024? The Fool. There you are right here, Aries. Just enjoying yourself, enjoying new experiences, okay? Kind of like, you know, living like fruitless, fancy free, and just kind of going along with the program, going along with the process here. Sort of like also taking some big risk here too. Obviously, sometimes when you take big risks, you gain big rewards here. The full card, Aries energy, Aquarius energy here. Page of Wands. So I feel like you're in this like very excited energy right now. You're just excited about everything. Everything that you're doing, everything that's coming towards you, everything that you're experiencing, you're just going into it just very curious, very excited, very eager to learn, very eager just to experience what you're experiencing right now. I mean, some of you guys could be traveling, okay? Um, and just experiencing new people and new cultures, all right? What else do we have here? We have the Seven of Cups here and Judgment, okay? Seven of Cups here, you know, I feel like at this time, I just feel like you guys are definitely just in this energy of exploring a lot of options at this time here. You know, some of you guys could be coming to a realization that, you know what? I'm going along with this program here, going along with this process, and you might be coming to a realization that, you know, there is uh, something that you really want to do here. I mean, it could be that you want to travel around or that it could be that you're stepping into something that's very artistic, you know, uh, something that's very creative, uh, something in the creative fields here with the Eight of Pentacles here and the Devil here. Okay. So I feel like what's happening is that I feel like some of you guys could be going through an awakening where I feel like you guys are working on overcoming this devil energy that could, you gotta, that some of you guys could be, you know, walking around with or carrying around with you, you know? So, uh, you know, some of you guys could be overcoming uh, drug addiction issues, uh, you know, uh, behavioral issues, um, uh, codependency. So I feel like there's a strong energy of the, you guys definitely working on yourselves here. You know, some of you guys could be working on healing that inner child here. All right. Tell me the devil card, the devil card and the three of swords here. Okay. There is someone in around your family member that could be overcoming like a medical procedure, some sort of sickness, some sort of illness here. And they feel like this person is getting better here. Okay. Eight of pentacles here. I mean, this could be you also. I mean, just apply this to your own unique situation with the Queen of Wands here, Aries, Little Sagittarius energy. At this time, I feel like a lot of you guys could be, you know, working on improving your health, you know, or just working on, you know, mastering the skills that you need to master in order for you to be successful in your career here. Okay. The uh, Judgment card. Page of Cups, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. I mean, there could be someone here that's coming in with an apology, trying to reconcile with you here, okay? Maybe this is an apology that you've been waiting for for a very long time. I mean, it could be that you're apologizing to yourself 
for you know lim lim limiting yourself and holding yourself back because of this devil energy here okay the uh seven of cups and the queen of cups cancer scorpio pisces here page of wands in the world so what's happening is i feel like a lot of you guys are definitely eager and excited to see the world i do believe a lot of you guys are traveling here some of you guys could be digital nomads here too uh where uh you know your business or that your work is all remote here so it allows you that flexibility flex flexibility and that freedom to move around we have the five of pentacles here in the fool so what's happening is i feel like you're overcoming fears and worries and insecurities here perhaps they're over overcoming financial issues here too all right what else do we have here for aries what else does aries need to know look out for work on for uh march 2024 what else does aries need to know we have the nine of swords here in the sun It, the, the the song that comes to mind when I see the Nine of Swords here and, uh, and the sun, uh, rain, rain, go away, come again another day. So I feel like you're definitely perhaps overcoming, you know, um, you know uh, some shadows or this dark cloud that has been casted over you here. And I feel like things are really opening up for you at this time where I feel like you guys are able to create the life that you want and manifest the things that you want. So I feel like, uh, you know, with the uh, magician here and the sun, you know, I feel like a, a lot of you guys are, uh, a lot of your manifestations at this time are definitely materializing here. And it's happening very fast, happening very quickly here. Okay, we have the eight of wands here. Queen of pentacles, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. And the Four of Cups here. You know, I feel like you feel really energized at this time here. With the uh, Four of Cups here. Feeling very enlightened. enlightened. Okay. So, you know, I do, I do feel like a lot of you guys are definitely experiencing happiness and bliss here. And just in this energy of surrendering to the process here. And just allowing the process to work itself out the way that it should here. The Sun. Eight of Swords, yeah, I do feel like you guys are definitely overcoming fear and worries. And I feel like you guys are definitely letting that go. You know, some of you guys could be uh, in this energy of letting go and healing from your traumas that you've been uh, holding on to that you haven't been able to let go. So I feel like, you know, this is a time where I feel like you guys are letting uh, a lot go. Just shedding all these layers here that you've been holding on to. Eight of Swords here and the Nine of Wands here. All right. You know, I feel like you guys are definitely learning from your past, learning learning from your mistakes, and in this energy of just uh, recovery and healing here. Okay. So this is happening very, very, very quickly at this time here. You know, and I feel like you're just, your heart is just really feeling very fulfilled right now. Okay. Because I feel like you guys are just doing very, very, very well for yourselves. You know, I just feel like with the Page of Pentacles here and the Ace of Swords here, you know, I feel like you guys are definitely getting more and more clear about your career path. I feel like, you know, even guy, even even though you guys are not feeling like if you guys are not millionaires, you know, you guys are just feeling really abundant at this time here. And I feel like a lot of the abundance that you're receiving is just going through your experiences and enjoying new experiences here. Okay, so Aries, I hope that this was helpful. I hope that this resonated. If it did, leave a comment down in the comment section below. Like this video, share this video, subscribe, hit the notification bell, and I will speak to you guys in the next one. Thanks, guys. Bye.